This product here is called GlyphoCheck. This measures glyphosate, which is Roundup, in food, water, urine. You can use it for your body. It comes with two kits in this one package. So when you open it up, it has an instruction sheet. Follow this. And if you want to measure glyphosate in your honey, follow these instructions. This says beer, this says cereal, and this is water. Use it for water when you test your urine. It comes with a series of vials. And here's like a very small one. And uh, here's a large one with a medium one inside. And these different vials have different liquids that are already in there. So follow the instructions, collect the urine. You have to put it from here into the medium sized one and then into the small one and just follow the instructions. And there's a test strip. The final thing to do is put a sample on the test strip. I'm not gonna open this one up, but it's in there. And then you can look at the colors of the bands. There's two bands and one is sort of a brownish color. And the other one is the same color, although it could be lighter, it could be non-existent, or it could be dark. So why would you run this glyphocheck on you? Is to find out if you have Roundup in your body. It, it disrupts a pathway inside your body called the shikimate pathway. And there's tons of research on this. It's damaging. Also, glyphosate acts like glycine. Glycine is one of the collagen proteins that makes your tendons and ligaments strong. So there's a very large uptick in ACL tears in knees in young kids, like 10 years old or 12 years old, and they run and then they cut left or right. Not that they're being tackled. They just cut to the right, for example, and they tear their ACL on their left knee. It's because they're, number one, drinking high fructose corn syrup, and number two, they're filled with glyphosate. Now, glyphosate is per pervasive throughout the population, and there was a study done, it was m more than 10 years ago, showing 93% of Americans have glyphosate in their urine. So basically, everybody has it. I've met one person who doesn't have it. I personally have been detoxing for quite a number of years, and my level is medium. When you get this test, I don't care if you buy it from me, from my office, or if you get it online somewhere else. If you have glyphosate in your body or any other chemical toxin, it doesn't mean you just start detoxing chemical toxins. That's at step six, right above my finger, there's, it says step, step number six. And there are five other steps you have to go through in order to prepare your body for detoxification, whether that's metals or chemicals or radioactive elements. For example, steps four and five have to do with parasites. If you have parasites in your, in your body, what's the point of detoxing? The parasites hold on to metals and chemicals. And it's known in the scientific literature, for example, you can have a parasite that weighs one gram, but it's five to six grams extra of metals and chemicals. These parasites are like garbage trucks. They hold on to toxins and they, they're living in your body. And you know, when a garbage truck goes down the road, it's like leaking that nasty smelling liquid and there's paper flying everywhere. It's just a dirty truck. Same thing with parasites. They go throughout your body and uh, they drop off garbage everywhere. Their, their main job is to clean up toxins like chemicals and metals. So if you don't get rid of the parasites in steps four and five, there's no, e there's no point in even doing step six. So you have, to, you have to go through these steps. The last thing I need to say is the reason why I'm bringing this glypho check up is because it's inexpensive. I have lab tests for chemical toxins that are $350, um, $560, $700, $1,000. There's a lot of different lab tests. And the more that you test, the bigger the picture you get as to how toxic your body is. This test for one thing, you do it at home. You read the results at home. You don't have to contact a lab. And uh, it's very simple and it's very inexpensive con compared to all the others. And you can use this as a metric. So when you go through a nutritional detox program, you get a reading on this. Then a year later, do it again. A year after that, do it again. And watch your progress for detoxification.